Jackson was born at 25 weeks and we realized he needed help pretty much as soon as he was born. It took him, uh, well, forever to do anything. So getting off his oxygen tube, getting off of his CPAP, um, he really wasn't doing, doing much even when we came home. So that was when we realized we needed some extra support. Having them come here was phenomenal because I also didn't have to necessarily bring him downstairs. I could just leave him upstairs in his room, in his crib. And it was also nice because they would show me how to do things within the house, so or within his room, or within the home. So versus when we go to outpatient therapy, um, which is still great, but a lot of the um, items they have are just specific to the therapy. Whereas here, we were taking everyday objects that we had in the home, um, and it was basically I could further his development and his therapy just being here. Jackson's biggest strides came after we we really worked on his um, his crawling and I we got him those the hip helpers. It was so funny because I did not want to get him the hip helpers, but Rachel brought over a pair and she was like, just try them and see what you think. And a month later he was crawling. For anybody who is interested, I would say reach out. It is a little bit scary when you're thinking, okay, my child um, might be a little bit behind in certain areas. It's judgment free. No one's thinking that you're not doing something that you're supposed to be doing for your child. So I would say definitely try it because um, they're very honest and open. Um, pretty much everything that we've worked on has been a partnership. So I would say just try it. <laughs>